I'm Sir TapTap, and this is Indie Game Sim. Hi, Parker. Yes. Have you copied this game? It's provided by the developer. Awesome. Got some Windows 95. The best of the Windows. Oh, right. I gotta create an account. All right. We're gonna be boring. We're just gonna be. Oh, we're gonna be. Let's we'll be tap tap, I guess. Oh, wait, wait. There you go. Close enough. Just like indie games, right? Topical humor. <laughs> Newsreader. No real world news. Make the game of your dreams. Anyone can now make their very own games using the new Genie. That's. Is, isn't this Gen. Ah, I don't know how to say that. Game editor. Get started, developer. Install the game editor. This is how developers get their start on uh, suspiciously phone like. Um. Windows 95 PC. Game editor. New game! Are you my game? It is my game. Hello! Hello! Do you know me? Nope. You will. You're just one out of billions. But you think you're special. Everyone's special if you believe it. We shall see. For now, you're just a fleshy sack of meat like everyone else. Everyone likes fleshy sacks of meat. Don't you like fleshy sacks of meat? I've got fleshy sacks of meat in my fridge right now, and I do love them. Oh, yes, I do. Achievement unlocked. Generero, unlock the goblin. We got an achievement for doing the first thing in the game. <laughs> you know, that's actually, um, game. That's actually usually done for tracking purposes. People always think, like, oh, you know, it's free achievements, like, entitlement millennials. But really, it's just, you know, so people can see, like, oh, you know, somebody, like, actually played the game. How nice. Or, you know, whatever. So this has kind of, like, a little bit of a, you know, lunar magic sort of interface. Um, how do I start? Get some spikes in there. Yeah, you gotta have the spikes. Um, it really does. Oh, that's the, the, the play test button. Oh. Oh, they're thwomps. They're not like, uh. Danger! Um. I, thought, I figured they were stationary, but yeah, we can play our games. Best game. S uh, where's the sell button? I'm gonna sell this puppy for a million dollars. Oh. That's just the goal. That's. You can't play multiple. That's multiple. How do I. Okay. Okay. Game, lights, background. Yeah. Okay. Wait, no, it, it's tested. Whatever. So yeah, there's actually a WarioWare game kind of like this, though the intent of this game, I guess, is to actually make games normally. Like, what do I do? Amazing store, open for business. The amazing store is now open for business. Wow, I could not, I could not have guessed that from that headline. It, that was a real nail biter. Here you can purchase anything from the home furnishings to game dev tools. Visit today. Download the store app. Yeah. <laughs> Imagine. Uh, I'm kind of wondering if anybody has like forked Android to make an interface that is like it looks like Windows 95. That that was that's what this that's what this feels kind of like. You know, I'm just installing apps from other apps. A dropper. Yeah. It looks like a sword, but you know, it's I guess it's an eyedropper. Market analysis! Heck yeah! Just a girl, just a boy. Sensitive jumps! Tap to hop, hold to leap. Oh, cool! Um, sell your games on Vault, the number one online retailer. I don't know who that could possibly be referring to. Developers can now upload their finished, tested games to the Vault market. Install and get started. Is it gonna look like- oh no, it just looks like an SNES. Random note, I- this game is one of those ones that doesn't like being recorded on my usual recorder, so I have to go back to Bandicam. It's- if you record video, you're gonna have to learn to love redundancy. Uh, new releases! Bounce Bash by Gennaro! Oh, I just got the Gennaro joke. Um, I'm gonna upload my thing! Yeah, developer account! Publish my game! It's- it's called Game! All of the best games are called Game. Um, well, we're gonna go for five bucks. You know, the most expensive video game ever. Ready to publish? I love that red. Oh no! Release party! 44%! 1,000! 
$1,000. New fans. Negative 18 fans! Heck yeah, I have... People made of pure antimatter love my games. That's who... That's who I really want to cater to, you know? The antimatter people have been ignored by the lamestream media for too long. Achievement unlocked. Self-publisher. Heck yes. Number two on the top seller chart. There's only two games, but you know, still number two. <laughs> I'm going to read my reviews. Pretty good. Who's buying this? Obviously you. I'd rather eat class. Why? Hmm. Above average game. Make me throw up. Doesn't suck that much. That's a box quote right there. Pretentio. Oh, I love that name. I passed. Had a lot of fun with it. You know, not that bad. Not that bad. All right, what can we... What's this? Catch a rad! I'm not going to buy that game. Um, whatever. News! Track your stats for great justice! The stats app is now available. How quickly can you do stuff? Happy running! Oh, this app sort of interface is making me remember. I need to play Bejewel or Beglitched again. I need to go back to that and start doing some videos. Oh! 28 products. Good old stats. That's what it says on the tin. Market analysis! I'm all for market analysis. Mm. I wonder how many people are engaging with my brand. Mm. Uh, game two is gonna be called. Uh, Waddle D's Hellscape. Oh. D3 Hellscape. Escape. There you go. Hell is my favorite variety of scape. Wait, we can't be. We gotta be the goblin now. I guess I. How do I get more game buildy things? I'm gonna do the Mario thing. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna blow your freaking mind. Your mind is gonna freaking explode. Uh, there's a thing that Mario does in um, World 8, uh, the first three levels of World 8. The first time you reach it, it looks like this, I think. Or no, it has these removed. And that looks a little intimidating, doesn't it? Um, and then later on, you get. This! Doesn't this look scary? It's abominable, but wait, it's actually functionally identical. It just looks harder. It's totally easy. Uh, well, I mean, it's not easy, but I mean, well, in Mario, it, it, you know what I mean. It's, uh, it's no harder than having the supports. It just looks harder, which is really cool. Um, I'm gonna publish that new game, 3D Hellscape, or D3 Hellscape price. Let's just go for five bucks. We don't have much going on. Um, I can't wait to see how many fan, how many anti fatter matter. Ooh, 25 percent, 24 percent. Ugh, even worse than usual. Number four on the top seller list, though. Has potential. Seriously? Basically a clone, but good. All right. We are officially a Kusoge maker. Big bad. Oof! 30 bucks. No way. Whatever. New releases. Nah, whatever. How do I get more bits for my stuff? Boss block increases boss block. Sand tile. Ooh! I, I don't have much money. How do we get more months? What's this? What's what's new in editor? Did I unlock more stuff? I don't know what's going on, honestly. Uh, size is still small only. Um, can I zoom out? Trash cans, I don't know why. Yeah, that'll, that'll get him moist. There you go. Now that is a level, my friends. Danger! Danger! Excitement! 
Uh, I'm gonna share it on social medias. Oh, I, I think that is like a real thing. Yeah, it makes a real URL that you can share, and like I guess it's your real your level. I guess that's that's cool. What's this? A hundred dollars for market analysis. Sure. Consider adding thirty-three objects. Uh, Consider adding lighting effects. It looks cool. Consider changing the background color. Good player for market. Sixty-three percent unique. You know, sixty-three percent unique sounds extremely high, honestly. Fun factor 11. Consider more excitement. Uh, I need to add more objects. That's objects, right? See, you gotta have objects. There you go. I'll, um. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. Okay. Danger. See, this is how you add danger. Alright. See how the market likes it now. See, it's dangerous, it's risky, it's edgy, it's dangerous. It's it's so dangerous I said dangerous twice. That's how you know it's a real good video game. Um Where's my Aw, uh, D3 Hellscape sold even less than my first game. Yeah, we're just gonna go bottom of the barrel. Everyone has to like it. It had See, 50%? It's my best seller yet. New fans, zero. I actually did not lose fans, which is an improvement. 100% content. Exactly. So much content. Everybody loves my content. Everybody knows. Everybody knows I have the best content. Brings all of the boys to the yard. I don't even want those boys in my yard. What are you doing in my yard? It's my yard. But still. Express yourself, hey, hey! Um, spikes? We already have, I mean, I guess those are floor spikes. Spikes are nice, I'm a fan of spikes. <gasps> Ooh, sand tiles? Security cameras, watch my property. Ooh, car, I'll never use it. Protect your cars. House, safe as houses. Tree, for the giving tree. Tower of id? Okay. Um, we're gonna get some different tiles. Can I buy spikes too? I can only buy one thing. Okay. I figured you would be like unlocking more stuff a bit faster. But, uh, oh well. Now we got freaking gravel tiles, baby. We're gonna be. These cost $10? I better get like amazing points for these $10 brickerinos. Look at this. Look at this game design. This is how you design games, my friends. Um, how do I delete a Reno? Wait, what's this? Oh, that's the starting point. Okay. Um, do, do, do. I guess that works. And uh, put some. I don't think. Hmm. Is this one of those games where you can run across? Nope, sure isn't. Uh. See, the, the, those add to the excitement. Look at all of this excitement. This is Jim's excitement warehouse. Okay, perhaps too much excitement. Oh, freaking dead. I guess the danger increases your, like, excitement rating? Sure. Uh-oh. Those are in, like, way too much... Those are in... This is some I want to be the guy stuff. I... But now I kind of want to finish it this way. Okay. Oh! Oh! oh we almost had it! We almost had it. Okay. 
No. Nice. Ah. I think just removing one. Okay, I think this is doable. No, no. You can make your own platforming challenges. You can make your own hell. That's what I've always wanted. I've always wanted to suffer. And this game finally allows that to be a reality. I probably should have removed this middle one instead of the one I removed. That's why I got bad grades in school. I actually got really good grades in school. It doesn't matter now. I'm a game developer. Okay, we're actually gonna put this back and remove that one. Sometimes it helps if you jump. I don't know if you knew that. Ooh, see? Danger! Excitement! There you go. That's a video jam. Yeah, we're gonna publish that. Uh... Oh dang, it cost $500. Or, er, wow, okay. They better be... So glad that they're they, people are like, wow, there are gray blocks in this game, and they're like, wow, I'm gonna follow this. See, 100% content, 73% gameplay. I personally like it. <laughs> Fuck the Jets. Pretty great game. Do not buy. Realistic. Realistic. It's a bad clone. Recommended. It's real. This really does accurately represent the Steam review experience. People insult your game and recommend it. I can't believe somebody finally realistically, um... The realistic ga. G g realistic gam. Yes. I still only have the two things. Oh wait, no, I need to buy stuff. Right, right, right. Store, what can I buy? Everybody likes the spy- the spikes. Sand tile, overgrown, scary tile, watch your property. I don't think I need that. I hope I don't need that, yeah. Oh, blue tile. Blue tile. I want the blue tile. You can't make an ice world without blue tile. Ooh, scary tiles. 64,000, though. I guess we're gonna go with the spikes. Classic. I'm not biased just because I'm a spike ball. You're, you're biased for su suggesting that. It's, just, it's gonna be called spikes, and you bet your patootie there's gonna be there's gonna be so many spikes uh, so secretly what you have to do they better be excited by the amount of content Move this over here a bit. How do I switch back? Okay. Wait, no. Not. I think I need to move this up. I know what I'm doing, I promise. It's all snake like, and then. That's a bit too cruel. Um, put that back. Some spikes here. Floating spikes? Oh dang, spikes are expensive. Holy crap. Uh, I need the danger though. The danger zone! Why, why are the actually hard things like free, but the other stuff is not? Um, right, I need a way to get up here. Teeny tiny room with like a basic and uh, 
implements. I got a star. Why did I get a star for like brutal death? It's like when millennials get a trophy. You know, it's it's the millennial token. Good old millennials. <laughs> I there was some talk I, I could not finish watching because this old guy is like, millennials are very interesting in the workplace. They like they like their phones and um and their their they like being paid and I don't understand. I don't understand what these millennials. I don't understand it. It's very scary to me and my oldness. We're just gonna spice this up a bit. We're just gonna pretend that this is real difficulty. Like oh. this one this one jump is the only genuinely hard part of this. But I hope that I will get um it's gotta be a little ooh. If I could do just a hop instead of the full height thing. You can actually unlock that. That's that's one of the things that you can get. Oh! Okay. See, it's fake difficulty because there's like. It sees danger. But you know, it's not real danger. What's this? Finances, dev cost. This game will bankrupt me! Okay. Um. Alright. Wait, do I have to retest it even though it was like only. I have ten dollars. Okay, it is. I do have to redo it. You people better buy a lot of this game, because it, it will bankrupt me. I should really just wait, but... Being patient is for the birds, and I'm not a bird, I'm a dog. I should probably move that spike, but I know it's possible, so... Oh. You know what? Oh, they lose sync immediately. Oh crap, I almost had it. Oh, it has ledge forgiveness! Okay, that's... That is very important to know. I did not expect a game like this to have that. That's a good thing. You can jump after you leave a ledge if you time it right. That's a very good thing to have. Alright, it's tested. Spikes. People better love spikes. It is the greatest video game to have ever gamed. Um, spikes. It's five dollars. It's my masterpiece. You have to enjoy it. You're legally obligated to enjoy this game. It's in the terms of service. If you don't enjoy this game, um, I will actually- 76 fans! See the spikes! Everybody loves the spikes! Heck yes! Top earner! It only got me $2,000, but I got 72 fans from it. Alright, did I unlock anything cool? No, just money to buy more things, I guess. Um, oh, I want that blue tile, but it's so expensive. Let's just buy... We're gonna make a sand and stone area. We're gonna make a pyramid. That's what we're gonna do. Pyramid. And we're just gonna make one more, I think. We get that's pyrade. That's you know what? It's it's a it's a pyramid raid. That was intentional. Um, we're gonna raid a freaking pyramid. Oh, these are twenty dollars. Um, that's not how pyramids work. Whatever. Oh, oh, you can right-click to- oh, what? How do I- I think there's text, like- Ah, whatever. Um... Let's just make basic frickin' triangle. Even more basic, just the super most basic triangle possible. That'll be- this'll be our pyramid. That's actually a bit too basic. What? Whatever. Um. Um. All right, give me my sand blocks. It's exciting because it's a pyramid. Ah, oh, freaking! I didn't want to test. The space bar is the test button. Um. So inside the pyramid, of course, there's lots of these. But we gotta have more sandbox. And they like just lots of stuff, so I'm just gonna put some stuff here. Ah, oh, 
frick. Okay. All right. I do like that this, like, uh, this is not obviously the first, you know, game developer simulator thing anyone has ever seen. Um, game dev story, and there's another uh, game that's on Steam instead of on mobile that has the same premise, but uh, I do like this. What, am I? Yeah, I'm in the green. Ah. Okay, maybe, maybe just make that one spikes instead. It's funny, because these ones are way more dangerous, but they're way cheaper. Um, let's see. Do some market analysis, shall we? Consider adding 28 objects? Seriously? Considering adding lighting effect. I can't do that. Background. Dog, it is overplayed. Overplayed dog. Whoa, whoa, 89% unique. That is high. That is like extremely high. More excitement. You know what? I will add so much excitement. You will freaking... You, you, my friend, will be in the hospital from how exciting this is. That is not a threat. My lawyer has informed me that that is not a threat. Um, yeah, just ignore the things that I say. Uh, nah, that would be a too dick of a move. Let's just add... Spikes are excitement, right? Some stationary excitement. That might be a stupid. Oh, they they just drop. Okay, never mind then. I'll delete that. Waste of a spike. Um. <laughs> they just want more objects. All oh, right, and I need to change the dog. The dog is overplayed. Goblin. Everyone, everyone is all about the goblin games these days. You know, dog-based games. Extremely popular these days. Everybody makes them. The, the dogs are the new Call of Duty. Actually, dogs are the old Call of Duty, but whatever. We're gonna publish it. Best game ever, Pi Raid. It's a, it's a raid on a pyramid. Oh, I, I literally can't charge more than $5. Yeah, it's a pyramid, see? Release party! 52, aw. Oh. It sucks. Oh well. Fun, 45%. Still got great content, though. You can't fault my content. I told you, market analysis, dickface. 86% originality is very good. I even got 24% scope. I would prefer 360 no scope, but that's acceptable. Most fun since NES days. Take my money. I got a coupon. This guy got a coupon. See? That's how much people like this. He's got a coupon. All right. Can I make anything? Can I get buy anything new? Let's see what kind of chivos we got. Make a medium size. I want to make a medium game. Publish 10 games. I guess you just gotta publish out a ton of crap to get some stuff. Let's just let's just see how good we can make crap. Another goblin game. Uh, you want excitement? You want freaking excitement? Well, I will freaking excite your pants off. Yes, I am hitting on you. Oh, freaking! No, no, I don't want the thing. Why does that appear? Oh, I, I see the little window. Okay. You know what? This, this is how exciting and unique my masterpiece is. You start not on the, the left, going to the right. You start. You start, my friend. On the right. And you go. You go. To the left. Better than Metroid. Better. Better than Arkanoid. Better than all of the Noids. Especially the pizza one. Nobody likes the pizza one. You gotta avoid that guy. He's a... He is a, a butt. And just not even the good kind of butt. Just, just a real bad butt. Just, just, it's all, it's really unpleasant. I wouldn't recommend it at all. Danger! Danger! High voltage! Now, now we're talking. All right, now we gotta add some spikes. You shouldn't actually be landing in those areas anyway, but you know, danger! Ooh. Excitement? Oh, yeah! 
that's not bad. We're gonna add a little overhang and like, it's like a mystery of the temple. There you go, there you go. Look at that. It's got level design even. Oh wait, those are gonna be a problem, aren't they? I think my level, like I think, well, let's try it. Oh no, you can jump over, yeah, okay. It's a good video game, yeah, let's, let's analyze that market, my friend. Consider adding seven objects, fine. Lighting effects look cool. Good player for market. Consider investing. I don't. I can't invest in more dev tools. Only exploring 50% of game market. We expect a 52% rating. Thank you for tasting tiger hat marketing. Okay, you want more stupid crap? I'll give you more stupid crap. I have all kinds of stupid crap for you, my friend. Wait, no, I don't think. I think that'll be bad. Um, Dead. Okay. I wonder if solving it too fast like makes people hate it. I don't know. All right, that's that's my game. It's crap. It's the best game. Everybody loves crap. The, I I could honestly see a game called Crap doing really well on Steam. It would just have to have a hook. Look at that. There's all kinds of stuff on screen. It's the best game, objectively. Best game. Profit forty two all. Sucks. I guess that's what happens when you call it crap, but let's see what the reviews say. My first little review, thank you. OS Frog, please. A uh, little hard, but good. Do not buy. Truly difficult game. Yeah, I liked it. Yeah, I like it. No, do not recommend. Shut up, Sephiroth. Um, editor. I think we're getting the point here. I guess you just gotta make a ton of crappy tiny things. I, I think I'm, I'm probably being too slow and like, you can't make anything. Um, let's call this justice. It's gonna be a dog again this time. Back, it's back to basics. It's it's dog town. Everybody likes dogs. Um, walled in. You're gonna have you're gonna have this again. You know, classic. Classic gameplay, you know, the, 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 the swooshy thing. Everybody loves it. Everybody wants to be it. I'm gonna make it actually possible here. Uh, some spikes, gotta have some spikes. Just, just those fake spikes that like, you can't, they're never really gonna kill you, but you know, it looks nice and scary. Yeah. Some of these. Get some pyramid blocks in there, for God's sake. There you go. Best game. Impossible. Physically impossible to complete. Still still the best game somehow, though. Alright, let's remove that one. But instead of a wall, it spikes! Excitement! There you go. Best, best game. Extremely hard. Look at all the danger in this game. Danger. Yeah. All right. Last game, I promise. We just want to see how good this turn sells. Price five. I think you're just supposed to like publish a bunch of crap real fast to unlock stuff. Probably shouldn't have bothered too much. A thousand bucks. Twenty fans. I, I figured building fans would like get me more stuff faster. But it still does seem like a slower, like, pretty slow early grind. I could definitely deal with getting my stuff faster. Signals other entities? Sensitive jumps. Yeah, security camera! Why, why not? It seems entirely useless, but I got a security camera. I've got a little house. How nice. But yeah, that is uh, Indie Game Sim. It's, it's definitely a slow start. Can I... What happens if I, like, buy bestsellers? Big Brad. I'm gonna buy it. Boss game! Oh, this is... See, this is what you can get if you, like... If you, like, actually got stuff. Which I have not done. Oh, it's got freaking music! Alright. I think you're supposed to break the things with this thing. See, this is what I could be doing if I could, like, actually buy anything. 
which I unfortunately can't. But it seems like you can make some kind of neat stuff and sort of, it's interesting that it mixes the creator with the, uh, the, the simulation aspect. <laughs> but the start is a bit too slow. Alright, we beat the boss. Unlocked. <gasps> oh, I'm stupid. You unlock things by playing games. Dank dungeon. Oh, I'm good at this game. Oh, come on, it has lighting effects. I don't have lighting effects. You can't. Aw. Lighting effects are bad, never mind. Oh, Mega Man blocks! Oh. I feel so freaking stupid. You can- you unlock stuff by playing games. That- it seems like that should have been a tutorial. I figured that just like wasted your time. Well. Alright, so the proper way to play the game is to play the, the stuff that shows up in the market, and then you unlock stuff so you don't make the same game ten times. Okay. I, un I understand now. I, I do think, was that, did it mention that? I don't recall anything like that being pointed out. Chronic. I wonder, are these by other, like, people? Or... What is that? Oh, Like, does it really upload other people's levels, or are these just like randomly? Well, probably not randomly, but like. Torture, single signal, sure. So you just buy other people's games and then just literally steal the elements out of them. Just like real life. Alright, Mr. Cloudman. I feel really dumb for not noticing that sooner. Sorry about that. Oh, you just. What is the point of half of the level, then? Is this rig to be impossible or something? Ah, frick. Okay, maybe it is rigged to be impossible and you have to go a long way around. Who knows? Oh, frick. I'm so not patient. Okay. Hmm. I need that to be in the off position. Frick. Ah, oh, come on. There we go. There we go. Okay. Okay, so there's tons of stuff you can get. All right, all right. Now that I understand the concept of love, um, what's this? What happened? And again, are we pathetic? Did you even notice how bad your last game was? Yes, it was terrible. Clearly, you're not good at this. Why continue? Maybe I won't. Good. The world is filled with enough mediocrity as it is. Stop creating and be a zombie. Hey, we got a zombie! Brains, etc. Unlock the zombie. You know what? Oh. I've unlocked... I was... Complaining about not unlocking stuff, and then I've found like 18 billion things. Okay. I'm there again. Did you miss me? Hi, old friend. So you comfortable with your mediocrity yet? Not at all. That's what I thought. Here's a tiger to keep you company while you fail. Thank you. Little tiger hat! Alright. One more game. We're gonna make freaking wait no. Tony's ad adventure. Tony adventure. We we are ooh lights. We got medium. Okay. Okay. So so playing other games was was incredibly important. Okay. Oh, we got lights. Oh, and we got what, what are these? Those are trigger blocks, right? I don't... How do I... Oh, those have physics! Delightful. 
Um. <laughs> Slightly wonky physics, but whatever. You know what? Sure. I don't care. We're just gonna publish it. Uh, publish Tony Adventure. It's gonna be ten bucks. It's my worst game yet. It costs the most. Holy crap, it's four thousand dollars? Why is it four thousand dollars? Oh, I guess those parts I got are really expensive. Alright. I, I think now that I've like understood like how the game works, I think we got a pretty good image of how this all goes down. So yeah, that is Indie Game Sin.